さをたっぷりと絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろ絶望しろNot everybody is happy for him, huh? o He o deflected it.、Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. それを奪っても意味はないぞグリモワール,ワールを使えるのは選ばれた本人だけだが四つ葉のグリモワールは闇のコレクターにとんでもない高値がつけられてる Really? Is that so? になりそうだもらっておくよ待てー<笑><笑>You like even. As a demon, oh, <laughs> the first episode is just simply superb. Okay, the first episode, I like the way they, they introduced some of the characters that we now know. Um, Esta, you know, uh, Rishivi, which is the bad guy that is trying to take away the green mirror, and uh. 
the others as well, which the more we go further, I will remember their names. Now let's move on to the Come on, EK. I built up my muscles since I could use my magic. <laughs> King too. Uh, get stronger and protect you. <laughs> mm. I'll repay you for this someday. Mm. You give me hope. Mm. <laughs> All right, guys, there you have it. What an interesting episode. What an interesting episode. I believe at this point, the stage has been set. The foundation has been laid, right? The dialogue, the foundation has been pretty much set up for what's coming up next. Now, uh, this pretty much based on these two orphans, uh, you know and Esther, or Esther and you know, they grew up in, in an orphanage and uh, they were taken in by this reverend father who loves them so much and pretty much wants to give them everything based on his own means, right? And there's this reverend sister who Esther always wants to marry, like I see that she's going to just uh, re renounce her vow to God and, you know, elope with him. I'm not sure what's going to happen in the near future. I'm not sure if he's, if she will ever go into to change her mind from that area, which I think it's probably hard for her to change her mind, but who knows? And you see the challenge. You see the rival between Esther and you know. When they were kids, it's based on the storyline thus far with these two episodes. Uh, you know, used to be the quiet. I mean, he's still the quiet one, really. You know, he used to be the quiet one. I would, ev I would even go as far as saying the weaker one, to some extent. But as you can see, because of the desire uh, to protect what is his, because of the desire to protect what is his, he uh, started using magic. You know, because he needed to get back. His necklace from the thief that wanted to trade it in for cash to go and and drink more booze, you know, to go and do some more <laughs> more Stone Cold Steve Austin drinking beer and all of that stuff. And uh, along the line, uh, because of um, Esther's wit, because of his personality, because of his motivation because of his will to never ever give up and as you can see the drunk continues to whip his ass to kick his ass in and out out and in left side right side you name it however you want to describe it whooping his ass countlessly but he never gave in he never gave up his desire never faded away he kept on coming for more he kept on pushing until he gets what he wants, until pretty much the drunk knocks him out. Then maybe, you know, until he blacks out, but he didn't black out. And because of his continuous uh, uh, motivation, he kind of overwhelmed 
the drunk. And what did the drunk do? He let the necklace go and was baffled. You know, who is this kid? Who the hell is this damn child? Coming at me like a thief, you know, he can actually take me on, you know. And that's where, I guess that's where the will of, um, of desire comes in. The will to never give up. Kind of reminds me a lot of Naruto, you know. Shout out to Naruto Shippuden. And you can see, because of his actions, he motivated, it inspired, you know, to want to do better. If he was doing 1% before, now he wants to do 10% more better. You know, he wants to get stronger. And right in there, their bond even became stronger, even before the final fight or what just happened between this, um, I forgot what his name was. I think his name was mentioned on the first episode. His name, something Rashid or something like that. One second, I hope I will find it. Ravishi or something, let me see. Uh, I keep clicking episode two. Hope I can find it, guys, because I know the name of this guy was mentioned just now. If I can't find it because of time, I will pretty much wait till the next episode. I will find it. something ravishy okay i can't find it right now because you know i'm just uh, skimming the episode pretty fast so i can't find it but i will do my research after to make sure that i find the name of that character who attacked them because i'm sure this will not be his last because um esther did not kill him but he pretty much demobilized him pretty he very much demobilized him from amounting any magic or amounting any attack and you can see esther is not used to that big ass sword just yet but he muscled up himself you know with the courage desire and determination he was able he couldn't swing that sword with his magic but he used his strength in order to swing it and because again saving you know the second time and you know, even becomes even more motivated and even respects Esther even more. Because I'm sure when what happened happened when they were kids, you know, along the line, the respect faded away between Esther and you know. But because this has happened again, that respect that he has for his orphanage brother kind of renewed. Now he loves and respects Esther even more as they get older. And he says, You have saved me again and for that i'm going to repay you back someday and now they have decided that they are going to be rivals but you know did say although i can be i cannot become uh friends with my rivals but for the sake of everybody for the sake of um protecting and helping the orphanage and everyone who is poor anyone everyone anyone or everyone who cannot afford uh to live comfortably we we are and we will team up to bring to become the wizard king and to bring goodness and good fortune to not just us and to people that we love as well so they have formed a good union and i hope that union will last but it's just good to see how the the two episodes just laid a good foundation on what to expect and um, I look forward for more episodes to come. So push your thoughts, guys, and let me know what you guys think of this or these epi two episodes. And uh, don't forget to check out Beautiful Halo for your latest anime merchandise. The link is in the description. Click it, it will take you to the site. There you can be able to make your purchase using my promo code MAME or MAMES to get your discount. And I look forward to seeing you guys on the next episodes. So on that note, continue to stay safe, stay classy.
and keep on keeping on. Ha <laughs> ha.